All right, Gemini's. What's up with Gemini? What are the messages that Gemini needs to hear today? My Gemini. Gemini, P.S. You guys are crushing my video views literally almost every single time. You guys are the highest watched. I feel like I should do a special reading for you guys. A shocker though, my Venus is in Gemini and my first baby, my firstborn son is in Gemini. So is my grandpa, my other grandpa. One was a Leo and one was a Gem. And my grandmother, my Italian grandmother, she's a Gemini Cancer cusp, cusp of magic. So is her father. All of the um, Italian people on my side, cusp babies, uh, Cancer cusp too, like Cancer Gemini cusp or Cancer Leo cusp, including myself. I, I researched our like genealogy and it goes back far. So many cusp babies, weird. Especially on that cusp of magic. My strega side comes from. Gemini, why do I want to shuffle over you forever? Gemini, are you avoiding something? You are. Let me pull it out of you. Give it to me, Gemini's. What are you hiding? <sighs> the Seven of Swords. I said, let me pull it out of you. I pulled the Seven of Swords. What are we lying to ourselves about, Gemini's? The Knight of Wands in reverse. What the fuck is this? The Devil in reverse. Gemini's let's have a discussion here yes it is toxic yes you do need to leave it alone no there's no way you can talk around it no there's no way you can like <laughs> rationalize keeping this around oh my god come on knight of wands in the reverse you know this how this ends <laughs> Gemini come on like listen yeah I think you guys are probably I say that you're the most intelligent sign I consider you the page of swords I think you're the ones that like to get the most information. You're like the, uh, the ability on you guys to gain knowledge of a situation and to analyze it and discuss it are bar none. You guys are the best. I see what you're doing here, all right? You've got something that appears as a devil energy, which is in the reverse, all right? Which means you don't want to quit that. I can't quit you. <laughs> Some of y'all, it's kind of like you're quitting. You don't want to quit smoking. You're telling yourself like, you know, oh, I just wait till New Year's or I'll wait till, you know, after Christmas or I'll wait till this day. Just fucking do it, all right? It's not gonna be any easier, depending on what day you do. It's so it's showing that it makes you like act in a very chaotic way with the Knight of Wands in reverse. It makes you like do you know make poor choices, and go after things that are not meant for you. It's it's an unpredictable energy. If it's a person, all right, you already know what you're dealing with. They're unpredictable. They don't give you any kind of stability. You cannot trust them. They're always in and out. You know they just they're not here to stay. But you're like you're still attached to it. Why? Because you got the Seven of Swords upright. That's the only, you know, card that's upright here. That means that you are intentionally, like, mentally, you know, doing these crazy gymnastics, trying to find a way to rationalize this, thinking that you can get away with, you know, dancing with the devil here. No, Gemini, you cannot. You're smarter than that. <laughs> you're aware that you're in Seven of Swords energy, and you're also aware that these things are devils, and that this, whatever this is, is causing you to move really reckless. All right, Gemini, use your brain. You know what the right thing to do is here. No, there is no like cheat code to allow you to keep whatever this is in your life. It's got to go. Devil energy needs to go.